Warning, I swear a lot. Hello everyone, how you doing? Today, I'm gonna do a little bit of FTL. I've recorded, I've played this game before many times, and I've even recorded episodes on it on my previous channel. But frankly, I wanted to do another one, because it has been several years since I played this game, and it is really good. I'm gonna go on easy, because this game's fucking hard. We're essentially just gonna try and do a run, and fucking see what happens. I'm not expecting we'll get to the end, because this game is fucking hard. There we go, we've got a crew. And I'm gonna throw in a cheeky little reference here. There we go. That's a good ship name as well, I think. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for the journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet can catch up. Hold your fucking horses. Uh, can we do any upgrades real quick? Yes, we can. One of a power bar so we can have engines at max power as well as weapons. So a lot of this is about power management. Essentially, you need to get to the other end of the fucking galaxy. We're currently in a sector and there's like seven sections in the game. You need to get to the end, get upgrades along the way, so you're strong enough to fight the final boss. But you can't dilly-dally because there's a fucking encroaching fleet coming through that will royally fuck up your day. But I'm confident that everything will be totally fine, we're gonna do great, no problems. There's no reason why there would be, surely. Scans reveal a large asteroid field nearby, let's explore it. We got some fuel. Oh yeah, that's another thing which I actually completely forgot about. If you run out of fuel, you are boned. And not in a particularly pleasant way, you're just boned. Another rebel checkpoint is monitoring the lo this location. A number of civilian ships are awaiting inspection. Any of them could be the Federation loyalists. The rebels haven't noticed you yet. I'm gonna attack. I'm gonna fuck them up. Hit the weapons, and then Artemis. Hit the shields. You can't do shit to us. Oh, you did shit to us. And now they can't fire on us, so let's cancel the Artemis. Alright, it's not firing anything anyway. Fuck it, hit their oxygen! Let's choke them out. Uh, it's not some bad, it's not bad stuff, but uh, we will not accept surrender. Fuck you. Should have thought about that before you became rebels. Get wrecked. Ship explodes, we get a ton of stuff. Everyone's happy. This is, oh, this is the wrong button. We'll leave that for now, because we don't really need anything. Uh, let's go this way. Scanners are showing intelligent life forms on a nearby planet. Let's go have a look. You land a small shuttle in an enormous field whose only occupants are small, brightly coloured, six-legged horse-like animals. Could they be what your scans picked up? Let's try and talk. You try to talk to them and they're just, you know, not... Meh, nothing. Okay, fuck it. That went well. Thanks. Glad I wasted my fucking time. Discover a nearby planet speckled with settlements, although none respond to your hails. Great! Thanks for wasting my fucking time! It should be called FTW instead of FTL. Fucking time waster. You spot a small rebel ship nearby. Uh, give me your shit. Oh, I bet you're trying to get away. Well, what if I fuck up your engines extremely hard? Let's see you get away then. Hmm? Exactly. And now they ain't got shit. One more volley will take them down. Clearly I'm an amazing ship commander, I mean, you can tell. You search the bird, but only come across blueprints and debris from broken machinery. A shame, but you take what scrap you can salvage. You said blueprints, did that mean we got shit? No? Okay, well, we got stuff for it, you know, can't ask for much more than that. I'm gonna go re Actually, no, better. It makes more sense for uh, Saunders to do that. Because I want to get his repair skill up if he's closer to all the systems on the ship. Because yeah, your little crew members have skills which increase as they do shit. I'm currently on engines, so I'm my engine skill is going up. Saunders is on weapons, so his weapon skill is going up, and his repair just went up. Sweetman is the pilot, so his driving skill is going up. It's piloting skill. Distress signal! We're there after this. It can't be that important, right? Or they would have just, you know, sorted it. As you jump into the system, there's a pirate, and he's a bitch. Get in there. Put out the fire. Sort it out. Oh, he's still got missiles. Fantastic. Switch on auto fire. Accept your surrender. Accept your fucking surrender. Yeah, go on then. The rebels will take him out anyway. Once their fleet rolls through, he's fucked. So, may as well give him a fighting chance. Alright, distress signal. Let's see what the big hollow blue is. I'm sure it's nothing. You arrive at the distress beacon near a small asteroid belt and find a ship with pirate markings partially crushed between two large rocks. It must have been illegally mining the belt without proper equipment. Trying to- I'm not gonna particularly try hard to dislodge this guy without fucking him up because he's a pirate, so... 
You fire a few volleys into the rocket, it starts to shudder and break apart. Without shields, the pirate ship takes a beating, but eventually pulls free, and they give me shit. See? That was clearly the right thing to do. Let's go to the store. And then we can loop round to get back up out before the rebel fleet arrives. Marvellous! Come on, give me some good shit. I've been saving up my scrap. Let's fix the ship first. Ah, oh, the flak is really good. Ooh, but that's good for destroying hulls. Which we could really do with. Yeah, let's get the hull smasher. I like it. Okay, so now we need to upgrade our weapon systems and then upgrade our power accordingly. Uh, it'll take a little while to do that. Uh, yeah, we're gonna need a little more scrap before we can actually utilize that thing, but once we do, there's gonna be considerably more firepower being thrown around. Automated rebel ship guarding stuff, give it to me. I want it. All we need to do is target its weapons and it's completely useless. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't shoot at me, sir. Uh, I don't really like that. Uh, it's very rude. Um, I know you're automated, you know, so you don't really have a say in what you do. However, you are still a prick. And now you're dead. So I hope you learned your lesson. Ooh. Pike beam! <sighs> oh, goodness. Oh. Do you believe I'm getting the vapors? You can cut across entire ships, assuming there's no shield to stop it. So, if you can mix that weapon with, say, the ion blasts, which I really now should have bought the last one, but it's too late now, you can decimate, absolutely fucking decimate a ship if you can take out their shields first with the pike beam. But, you know, one thing at a time. Still, that's exciting for me. Oh, if we could replace either the Artemis or the Burst Laser with an Ion Charge, we have two weapons designed to tear apart hulls. Oof. I'd say probably get rid of the Burst Laser for a Ion, like, a fucking Ion weapon, because the missiles can already go through shields. So we could target their fucking... their shields, their shield generator with that. But if it turns out they have a drone which will block missiles, like intercept them, then we'd have the ion charge capable of chipping away at their shields anyway. Plus the hull laser itself, while not ideal for breaching shields, can help breach shields. So we'd have a variety of things we could use here. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is good, this is good. Things are going well. Potentially well. They could also turn out to be a fucking disaster. Like, there's no real way to tell by this point. We're in the first sector. You receive a request. All of our military ships have been destroyed or damaged during the rebellion. However, there have been reports of a Mantis war camp only a few jumps from us. Can you help? I'll do what I can, boy. And he gave me some stuff. I believe their camp's in the next sector because it doesn't look like it's here. Let's get out. Let's, uh, let's leave. Met the long range beacon. You arrive at a beacon located in a civilian star system, a nearby colony contacts you. have got a rogue rebel ship harassing this system. Do you have time to find it? Yeah. I tracked him down. Now, let's fuck him up. You know, whenever everything charges. Oh my god, we could murder him right now. Oh! Oh, that was vicious. Oh. That was disgusting how much damage that did. You've made your point, we are beaten, take these and leave us to our shame. Uh, sorry, you were attacking civilians, so maybe you should get fucked. We do not accept surrender. Except, you know, occasionally. Ship explodes, giving me stuff. Uh, let's send Saunders to quickly fix that room. Oh, there's a fire! Oh, fuck me, I wasn't paying attention. Shield's critical. Oh, oh no. Well, isn't that a slight issue? Oh, come on, boys. Ah, uh, <laughs> could this be the end of our adventures already? <coughs> oh, oh, yeesh. Uh, um, uh, don't worry, I have a way to fix this. I have a way to fix this. Vent the oxygen. <laughs> that, that caught me by surprise. Didn't think we actually caught fire. That's why you want your cameras fixed at all times, because you can't tell there's a fire going on if you, uh, don't have them. Wait for oxygen to flow back through. There we go. Now, give this a quick fix. Jesus Christ, I was trying to roll a cigarette and then all this shit fucking pops off. Scared the shit out of me. How dare you? How dare you, fire? I think you're so good, because you're technically plasma. You're not good. You suck. I use it to cook my bacon, that's it. World's biggest problem. Do I have a lighter nearby? Turns out, I do. To the next sector, let's go!
Mantis or Rock? Well, considering that mission wide has to deal with Mantis, I assume that's the direction we're going. You've entered a poorly charred area of space that's known to be home to the Mantis. Ensure your hull plating is up to scratch and that you have enough fuel in the tank to make it through. I'm confident, he said. Not totally not lying. You hear a grating rattle and a soft clicking. You reach for your pistol. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Let's pin them down in that room straight away. We don't need them fucking with shit. Okay. Oh, fuck. They've moved to that room. That means we can only fight them two on two. You go there, and you go there. Alright, now Sweetman can go heal. I will take his place. And then you go up there, you go in there. Swap over. Oh fuck, I'm about to die. Okay, get me out of there. At this point, uh, crew is definitely more important than any hull damage we might accrue for them attacking our systems. Because we've only got three crew members, so yeah, that's fine, we'll deal with that. I assume they're attacking shields now, that's correct. That means all three of us can hit them at the same time. Give it two seconds, just for Sweetman to get a little more healthier, and let's get in there. Come on, rough them up. There we go. You go fix that. You two, heal. Actually, Sweetman should get back to, um, there's no point leveling up Sweetman's repair skill, because he's the pilot. So he is going to be in the pilot seat at any given time. Which means chances of me taking him away from the pilot seat to go repair things is low. May as well get these two guys to get their repair skills better, because they're more versatile. Purely because they are positioning. Okay. And everyone, except for Sweetman, got a bit of fisticuff skill. That's nice. Okay. Well, we got fuck all from that. That could still go back to the store. Be more efficient to go this way. Alright. Merchants are not highly respected among the Mantis race, so if you undertake the profession, you're mildly surprised to receive an advertisement from a nearby space dock. Let's see. Hmm, I don't really have enough for anything. Can I sell something? Oh, I could sell a weapon. That missile is quite useful, though. But I could really do with another crew member. Like, it would be very helpful to have another crew member. I think especially in Engi. Although Vetus Varnus, hey. Um, Rockmen are very, very good at fire suppression and security. You get people on your ship, they will get them back out. But Engi are fantastic at repairing ship, but they aren't very good at security. Either way, we'd need to sell something. I know I was talking it up really hard, but I think the pike beam needs to go. I think this is a good purchase. Now, do we want a Rockman or an Engi? We'll take an Engi. Welcome on board, Will. All right, now let's get going. We still have a quest to fulfill, after all. Two, technically. You're immediately hailed by a Mantis ship. Your ship would be great, so we're gonna take it. I don't think you will. Oh, they've sent a boarding party. Of course they have. Just gonna send uh, Saunders over to help out. Oh, they're trying to run away. Alright. Um, Saunders needs healing. I can stay on engines, so that's fine. As long as we kill them. There we go. We got a ton of stuff. My next plan for an upgrade. We just need one more unit on the, pe on the weapon control system. So we can start using our missiles again. Then we have two means of breaking down shields and something to punish them once we have. And I think that'll be really clutch. I think we'll have a, a solid build, not an amazing build, but a solid build going by that point for the ship. I've only got 85, but I'll be okay. I don't need too much. I'm a bit of a martyr, you know, I can take a few hits, keep working. I used to work in retail. Help, we're being overrun by some sort of giant alien spiders. Fuck that, no. Goodbye. Not having it, nope, no, 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 no. You detect and retrieve an escape pod. You consider returning it to space when you learn it's a mountainous. Yeah, fuck that. Head to that distress beacon. Probably should have gone to the quest first, to be honest. It's more important to complete. Ship emitting the distress beacon is like, ah, we got fuck all fuel. Let's give them some. Give them the fuel. And there's some scrap. Oh, yes, we can upgrade the weapons. Yes. Yes, bitch. 
Alright, let's get to the quest. I hope we find a store soon, because we do need to buy some more fuel now. You find a mantis encampment, but there are far too many of them to count accurately. You send a long-range message back to the settlement with your findings, but unfortunately there's not much you can do. It would be suicide to attack directly. Well then, let's bombard them. You fire at their fuel depot, but a shot from the planet's surface rips the missiles to shreds. Oh, well, I probably should have thought of that. Oh, well. Let's fuck them up anyway. That on shields. That on weapons. We'll wait for the whole laser, because we want to make sure the shields are down before we fire with the whole laser, because it's a, it's a valuable shot, if you will. We want to make sure it counts. Excellent. And then we fuck them up. Easy. See? That's what I mean by good build. With the patrol ship fucked, we're going to get the hell out of here. Stress signal. Oh god, I hope we find some fuel. We probably should have waited for our fucking shields to regenerate first, but that's fine. Oh, I must hit their shields. They've got a drone. It's a boarding drone! Fuck! Alright, all hands. Fuck me. Oh no. Oh no. Get rid of it now. That thing is a huge problem. Thank god it attacked the medbay. Because it means we get free healing. Okay, uh, weapons, and you hit their hull. Uh, nah, it's fucked. There we go. Because the problem with uh, boarding drones is not only are they inc insanely tough and can be sent straight to your ship, but when they board your ship, they go in through the fucking hull. So they cause a hull breach, which means you need to kill it quick, and then you need to fix the hull before all the oxygen drains out of the room. So they are a double whammy of stupid bullshit. Once again, fortunately... It attacked us through the med bay, so we got a distinct advantage when fighting it, and then when fixing the ship afterwards. Because even though we'd lose HP from the oxygen drain, we gained HP from the med bay. I don't know if we're going to make it out in time, but we do at least have enough fuel to leave. So that's something. This has been quite stressful. <laughs> oh, God. This is nothing, so that's fine. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. The fucking fleet are on their way. We need oh, fuck! Great, so we're going to be on fire, and we've got borders. Oh, four of them! Oh, fuck me. We need to keep Sweetman on deck so we can fucking get the hell out of here. We probably should have waited for them to go to the med bay. Oh, this is bad. This is not good. This is actually really bad. We're going to take some damage. Alright, everyone, get to the med bay. If we're lucky, they'll follow us in there, and then we'll get healing. Nope, they went to the weapons. I'm leaving Sweetman on the, on the uh, pilot seat so he can get us out of here as soon as possible because fires are going to start. Alright, let's get the fuck out. They're still doing their thing. If oh god, no. Oh, bollocks. Okay. Oh, and they've attacked our weapons. Oh, shit. Alright, I think we're looking at a, uh, a fucking hit and run here. Like, we're going to have to wait for the FTL to charge and we're going to have to get out of here. Oh, and they've boarded us as well! Fucking sick! Oh, this is bad. We at least kill one of them. No! Get out of there. Oh, fuck me. This is not good. We need to fix the med bay. We might just have to wait for him to come to us. Like, otherwise, we could just die. Oh, that was bad. Alright, we've still got engines. They're currently attacking... Not attacking the med bay. Our weapons are gone. There's a fire over there. They haven't hit oxygen yet, so they're not going to starve us out. They haven't hit engines, so we can still work on getting away. Oh, shields are down, though. Fuck. Alright, shields are back up. Get in there. Fix it. Now... Now they're attacking the oxygen. Bollocks. Okay, you two. Get in there. You. Get in there. Oh my god, fire! Oh! Oh, Will! Oh, get out of there, buddy. It's not good. And they're attacking the engines, bollocks!
Oh no, fire is getting the engines, and our door controls are all locked up. Okay, okay, okay. Shit! One of them died, that's good. Okay. Alright, you. You two, get back to the... Med bay. Oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh, oh you, get back in there, oh god, get back in there, oh, well, okay, we lost someone, it was me, and Saunders, Ah. Uh, okay, 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 no, we're fucked, it's over, we can't, oh my god, we're screwed, we're totally screwed, fix the doors, and the oxygen's gone again, and we're dead, fuck. <laughs> 